All right, so today we are going to talk about the highest paying digital marketing skills in 2020 and beyond. At least a six figure job that is considered highest paying uh, or a high paying job. And unless you live in San Francisco, then $100,000, you are considered low income, unfortunately. So highest paying job when it comes to uh, digital marketing. The number one thing that is always in demand is someone that is not only just a good marketer, but a good manager as well. Every time I talk to a CEO out there, they're always asking, hey, Eric, I'm looking for a VP of demand generation, a VP of marketing, a VP of, it's always a VP of marketing in some way, shape or form. And these VP of marketings, they'll get paid, you know, $100,000, $150,000 plus, um, sometimes even up to $500,000 plus, depending on the company that you're working for. If you can somehow marry your marketing skills with management skills, that's where you truly create leverage because you know how to manage people. That's worth a lot. Um, the fact that you're actually good at your job and you can manage people, that's that's icing on the cake right there. So if you can manage to do that, that'd be great. I recommend reading a book called The High Output Management. That's by uh, the late Andy Grove, who ran Intel. And uh, becoming a good marketer, just listen to marketing school, or you can just look at this channel, and then you'll just continue to get stronger at that. Uh, the second thing I would say is paid media. So one of the biggest the second biggest thing that people are looking for is always paid media managers these are people that are managing are managing the facebook uh, ad accounts or the google ad accounts or the amazon ad accounts pinterest ad accounts all these different ad accounts they know how to be dynamic with those accounts and um, these people are always in demand and these can pay anywhere from you know we're talking on the low end um, maybe if you're starting out it could be thirty five thousand dollars a year um, up to you know over a hundred thousand dollars per year depending on, depending on your experience now if you want to be really good i would say another high paying digital marketing job is an affiliate marketer an affiliate marketer is can be good at paid media, but they know how to maybe um, leverage other people's email lists and, and be creative with uh, you know their media buys out there because they know they're getting paid on performance. So um, you know their 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 vested interest is to find a campaign that performs really well and just to you know double down, triple down, quadruple down on it. So affiliate marketers are um, you know something not a lot of people talk about them because it's, affiliate marketing is kind of a dirty word. But if you leverage it in the right context for the right company, you're gonna be able to go really far with it. The fourth thing I'll say is copywriting. So check out the book the boron letters or check out the book breakthrough advertising but the best copywriters in the world they can make over six figures for one sales letter because one sales letter can generate a ton of revenue for a company even if you don't become a really good copywriter you just read these two books you get a little better at it it's going to take you a long way it's going to teach you how to write good headlines it's going to teach you how to uh, get people to take an action from your ad and that's going to be high value because you're going to decrease your ad costs and then you're going to be able to perform better when it comes to to sales um now the other thing i'll say is when you think about the role that that's going to continue to get bigger is data science because people talk are talking about machine learning ai they're talking about all these different um kind of new technologies coming out when you think about technology data and technology go hand in hand so you know the, the best companies are going to have data scientists crunching the numbers and cr crunching the numbers to draw really good insights out and then be able to make those make business decisions that are going to drive we're talking massive kind of revenue differences um for their for their business in the long term so i recommend checking a company out called data camp there's a lot of um free data science courses out there online that you can just google as well but data scientists i mean that role i don't see going away for a, a a long time maybe ever and um the, i think it's going to become more and more demand just like engineers were in high demand and still are in very high demand um back when you know the internet started becoming a thing um and back in maybe in the intel days too but data scientists i think that's going to become bigger and bigger i remember when i worked with data scientists the insights that that person drew out man they were killer and it gave me so much confidence to move forward um with my campaigns and um, it made a world of difference for us and it helped us um, be really, really profitable. So final thing I'll say is SEO. Microsoft actually listed SEO as the number one job in demand or the most useful job, I think over the next five to 10 years or so, which I find fascinating because my background started in SEO as well because the best entrepreneurs I know are actually good at SEO. They understand SEO, they understand business, they understand culture, they understand recruiting. Sure, they understand the other like paid media and all that too, but you layer that on with SEO, you're playing a completely different game than everyone else. Sure, you know, there's real estate moguls out there. They understand, you know, they have the relationships, they understand where, you know, where they should be buying, you know, property, what type of property they should be buying and all that. Um, that's a lot more competitive. I didn't want to play there, but if you understand SEO well and the strength of a website, you can basically say, I'm going to go buy all these websites. I'm going to combine them together. And then I'm going to make, um, I'm going to make this giant website that gets a ton of traffic. And I know how to grow the traffic too. Um, that is a very, very strong skill. So you, I mean, that, that's a skill where you can make really good money doing it and eventually go off and, and do your own thing when you become really good at, uh, when you become really good at SEO. All the SEOs I've known that have worked at big companies, they're now off doing their own things. And, um, you know, 
I can say it's safe to say that it, it worked out for them. So let me know in the comments what you think I missed in terms of um, these high potential digital marketing jobs. And don't forget to uh, rate, review, and subscribe whatever platform you're coming from. Hit the bell button if you're on YouTube and check out the next video over there. And we'll see you tomorrow.